Hi, uh, this video tutorial I will cover uh, Servlet Lifecycle example. Uh, to explain uh, Servlet Lifecycle, I have created uh, Servlet Lifecycle Servlet which extends uh, HTTP Servlet. Uh, this class provides uh, implementation of uh, three Servlet Lifecycle methods. Uh, the first method is init method, second method is service method and uh, third method is uh, destroy method. And uh, this init method will be called by the Servlet container only once. Okay. To initialize the servlet and uh, this service method will be called by the servlet container multiple times uh, to process the request and uh, this destroy method will be called by the servlet container only one time so whenever we shut down the server uh, this uh, destroy method will be called so meaning uh, whenever a servlet goes uh, out of service uh, this method will be called okay and uh, I will deploy this uh, server lifecycle uh, web application. Export, select the var file, next, browse, and place the server lifecycle dot var inside the uh, web apps folder of uh, Tomcat. Click on finish. Then I am starting the server. Uh, server has been uh, started. Now I am accessing the web application using this uh, URL. I am clicking on enter after uh, entering the URL in the address bar. So it will show the index.html uh, content. Okay, So I am opening index.html. So this is the index.html page which is a home page. So this content is uh, displayed here. So here uh, we have a link uh, servlet lifecycle test. So I am clicking that. So it will append uh, hello. Okay. So this is the URL pattern, and it will send this uh, request to the web server. Uh, web server will uh, delegate the request to the uh, web container. Then what web container will do is uh, it will check uh, the URL pattern hello is there in the web.xml. Okay. In the servlet uh, mapping uh, tag. So it is here. Okay. So based on this, it will identify the corresponding uh, uh, servlet name. So based on this servlet name, it will identify uh, corresponding uh, servlet class. Okay. So servlet class is servlet uh, lifecycle. So once uh, web container identified uh, this servlet uh, lifecycle class, uh, it will uh, load this uh, servlet lifecycle class, and it will instantiate the servlet lifecycle class. Then it will call the init method of uh, servlet uh, lifecycle instance okay so it will call uh, this init method okay so this init method will be called by the servlet container only one time so i will show you the console output so you can see init method is called okay and immediately uh, once servlet is initialized it will call the service method so you can see service method is called one time so that i am uh, displaying in the browser also okay so now i am sending the request again by uh, refreshing this uh, page so this time it won't call the init method okay it will just call uh, uh, service method you can see here okay so you can see init method is called only one time but the service method called two times okay so after that uh, whenever i send the request what happens is only service method will be called so i will refresh the page multiple times so you can see service method is called 10 time we can see here also okay so the service method will be called multiple times by the servlet container to process the request but init method is called only one time to initialize the servlet okay and uh, destroy method will be called when we uh, shut down the server so i am shutting down the server so you can uh, see destroy method is called okay so destroy method will be called by the servlet container only one time uh, whenever uh, the servlet is uh, taken out of uh, service okay and uh, this is about uh, servlet lifecycle example and uh, thanks for watching bye